Hey everyone, today we're going to be seeing if we can actually get rid of plastic in landfills using Piranha Solution. And I'd like to thank ExpressVPN for sponsoring this video. Now the plastic that is in Coke bottles and a lot of other products is called PET. And it's very hard to break down. It lasts for a long time. So this is actually a pretty strong field of research. They're trying to find ways that they can break down this PET in a controllable way so that it doesn't just end up sitting in landfills for hundreds of years. But the problem is normally when you burn stuff, it creates side products. For example, when you burn wood, the smoke that's coming off of it is essentially things that didn't get turned into water and carbon dioxide, like tars and different viscous materials. Now this especially occurs with plastic because of the high temperatures, a lot of side reactions can happen that create very toxic materials. So you're not supposed to burn plastic. But the question is, what if we actually put plastic in piranha solution? So first let's see what happens when we just put a stick of wood in it. So the first thing we add is sulfuric acid. And then next we add concentrated hydrogen peroxide. Okay, here we go. Whoa, that's crazy. Look at it just go into it. And so basically it just turns it into almost pure carbon and takes off a water molecule from it. And then that pure carbon that's left in there reacts with the hydrogen peroxide products like oxygen radicals that are in the solution now and it reacts with it to form carbon dioxide gas. It's just melting away in there and eventually the solution just turns clear afterwards. No trace of any material in there whatsoever. Okay, now let's see what it looks like when you put a plastic Coke bottle in there. So you can see that the Coke bottle had a harder time dissolving in the piranha solution. In fact, I had to add more hydrogen peroxide as well. Because if you remember what's happening, the oxygen that's in the hydrogen peroxide is actually reacting with the carbon in there, and that's forming the carbon dioxide. So basically you have to continually supply hydrogen peroxide to it so that it can continue to react. But the main thing that's breaking down the plastic in there is actually due to the sulfuric acid. So actually you could just use sulfuric acid to do this and not rely on the oxygen from the hydrogen peroxide. Now if you actually just use sulfuric acid to break down the bottle, you could actually turn the PET into terephthalic acid, TPA, and ethylene glycol. So basically you can turn this plastic into other reusable products. And I've read a few papers about methods of doing this. I'll put a link in the description, you can check it out. But there's been a lot of research into ways that you can use sulfuric acid to break down PET. Basically chemical recycling of plastic. So this is a viable option, but I think the main thing comes down to the cost of it. Right now it just costs so much less to throw the plastic in a landfill than it does to convert it into usable products or to convert it into carbon dioxide and water. So unless we can find a cheaper method, we'll probably just keep piling up plastic in landfills. And I'd like to thank ExpressVPN for sponsoring this video. So whenever you use the internet, it's almost like you're sending a postcard in the mail for everybody to see. Everything that you use is sent over an unencrypted network for anybody to grab and use as they want. But when you use a virtual private network like ExpressVPN, it's like putting a package or an envelope around that postcard and it creates a secure tunnel between your device and the internet so nobody can peek in. So why use ExpressVPN compared to other companies? Well, ExpressVPN has the fastest speeds. It's consistently faster than any other VPN provider. 
It has 24 seven customer support. It's very easy to use. It's physically impossible for any ExpressVPN servers to store logs of any customers. It's been the top rated VPN provider rated number one by TechRadar, CNET, The Verge, Comparatech, and many more. So for me, whenever I do my online banking as well, I like to connect to ExpressVPN. I can just choose any location here. Right now I have it selected as Dallas. And now I have a secure connection. I can go anywhere I want to go. So find out how you can get three months free today by going to expressvpn.com slash the action lab. And thanks for watching another episode of the action lab. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell so you can be notified when my latest video comes out. And thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.